What is going on guys? Today we've got Saint Maximum, the Inform 86 with a 5 star 5 star. He did have a card exactly like this, which was a Flash SBC, which cost literally 53,000 coins with pretty much the same sort of stats. He's got the Trickster playstyle, plus still, he's still a 5 star 5 star, but at the minute, this card's coming in at 330,000 coins. We have got a great amount of pace on 93 on each. Dribbling wise looks phenomenal. Passing's decent enough. The free kick accuracy and long pass is taking it down, which is absolutely fine. And we have got a bit of shot power on him. In terms of chemistry style, I can imagine a lot of people are going to be looking marksman, finisher, anything other than pace because naturally you just want the best out of his ability. If he was going to go with the marksman, it'd be controlled explosive with 87 shooting and 96 on the dribbling as well, turning him into a 90 left wing. We have got the tricks to play style plus technical normal, flare normal, and also a quick step normal. So let's jump into him and see what Saint Max can do. So going into the overall four say Max then, he is as good as you expect. The five star, five star, beautiful. He's got that acceleration mixed with the sprint speed as well. He is now dropping as well. He's 304,000, which is a little bit of a 30k drop since obviously the start of it. So about an hour. I could imagine he will drop further as well. He's not necessarily the most expensive player normally. I could see him sitting above 100 but maybe not too much naturally it depends on the demand but when we already have the 86 that will already take out some uh, de uh, demand because naturally there should be quite a few people that did manage to do him 
When it comes to the card itself, the Marksman actually was a phenomenal shout for it. You could go with the finisher as well, but I believe when it comes to it, we do get more on, obviously, the reactions, the ball control and the dribbling, whereas, realistically, we don't need too much on that agility balance anyway. The big, the kind of big bonus we do get with the finishing is you do get the finishing on a plus 12 rather than a plus 8. So that, again, is going to affect it. You don't need technically get an 89 on the winger there, but you would get 90 if you go with the Marksman. So, you know me, I love a good overall. In terms of the card, though, he's nice. He's nostalgic more so than anything. I think he can get, definitely get the job done. You've got the links, France. If you wanted Saudi players, there is an abundance now, most definitely coming in with their huge amount of specials. So that's not a problem whatsoever anymore. And I do think it will continue. And hopefully at one point, you could potentially put him into an evolution. At the moment, I think the pace is that little bit too expensive, but, or too high, in fact because we have got the team of the week upgrade here but I believe there is a max 84 pace so unfortunately it's mainly out argued at kind of midfielders and also on that center mid run or center mid center backs so overall very happy with the card he's definitely going to drop down in price which is even better for him and I think the only thing I would like different is maybe the play style plus, but naturally a five star, five star normally has to have that trickster. So let me know down below what you think and I'll catch you all for the next one.